Matteo Martin Motorsport BMW has locked out the front row of the grid for the final race of the season. It was Antonio Felix da Costa who sprinted into the early lead, but the championship contending car of Fran Rueda got bounced down the order through the opening sequence as he lost out to Philip from Villa on the way into Turn 1. was then pushed wide at Turn 2 and that opened the door to Mario Farnbacker to sneak through. Meanwhile, further around the first lap, Johnny Molum having a home together with Nono Figueredo, putting Molum out of the race and bringing the safety car out. That served to bunch up the field. And when we did get back racing, Rueda gambled all, looked to make the move on farm back, but it also opened the door to Andrea Caldarelli, who was able to jink through and ahead of the BMW. Fortunately for Mike Benham, it was a race that ended in disappointment. That spin ended him in the gravel. Meanwhile, post pit stops, Marco Mapelli just had to guide the car up the order in order to net the points that he needed to secure the championship for Giovanni Venturini. And Mapelli, as is ever the case, did a fantastic job of achieving just that. It wasn't exactly pleasant watching for Venturini, but once Mapelli was able to move clear of Renat Salikov thereafter, he could ease away. This was the move that side the race. Albert Costa to the inside of Lorenzo Beirao de Viega late on as for Fran Raider, it all came to naught. So final win of the season for Albert Costa and Philip from Avila, the Emil Frey Racing Lexus squad, ending the year on a high. Second place to Lorenzo Beirao de Viega and Antonio Fitz de Costa with Marco Mapelli finishing in seventh. And that was enough to give the championship to Giovanni Venturini and the Imperiale Racing Lamborghini team.